Hello, I am Jito Jos, the CEO and the founder of Doptit.com, an exclusive digital marketing agency that specializes in higher education. You are watching a video series where I reveal my most successful digital marketing strategies. In the previous video, I shared the various individual steps taken to increase the leads, such as social media campaigns, referral schemes, SMS campaigns, and implementing these campaigns in select countries all across the world. In this video, I will talk about how we increase the conversion rate and reduce the manpower with the help of artificial intelligence and big data. Over the years, we became the highest data holder in the field of online MBA. At one point, the Alexa ranking for our company was number one in the online MBA segment. The team size grew to 100 and we had achieved the highest data in record time. Now the question was what next? We began focusing on how to increase conversion rate. Steps taken to increase the conversion rate are as follows. Bulk emailing. Bulk emails were sent out to the acquired leads that increases the rate of admission. Webinars were created at regular intervals about the latest topics and were added to the mobile app and YouTube channel. Thus, the YouTube subscriptions increased. Also, the webinars were emailed to acquire database. A very crucial step. The time taken for the data processing was reduced drastically from 24 hours to 5 to 10 minutes. This step particularly helped in increasing the conversion rate. I shall explain how this was achieved. We conducted a big data analysis. In that analysis, it was observed that certain percentage of the leads may be bad data. Let's try to understand this with an example. Suppose there are 20,000 data and 100 counselors. Each counselor process 200 data each. All the data in hand doesn't have to be relevant to the business. Sometimes counselor gets no response or it could be wrong number. Other times candidates won't be eligible or the data would be irrelevant. This constitutes bad data. On the other hand, good data is someone who responds to the call or gets back to you with more query. There is a possibility that the counselor is wasting his energy on 50% bad data. So that means 100 counselors are processing only 10,000 data. To change that, I delegated two counselors to make the call first. They sorted the bad data from the good data and forwarded only the good data to 50 counselors who now processed 100% good data, thus increasing the rate of conversion and manpower reduced from 100 to 52. This increases the efficiency to 100%. Next, let me explain how I implemented artificial intelligence in order to increase the admission with an example. Suppose from Google search, we acquired 100 data of which the conversion rate was 10%. From Yahoo, only 50 data were acquired, but the conversion rate was 18%. Likewise, data acquired from Monster.com was 100, but conversion rate was just 3%. Through chat again, a 100 data is acquired and the conversion rate was 5%. Suppose there are 4 counselors. A, B, C, D. Who will be processing this data in order to achieve admissions? A achieves 7% admissions. B achieves only 3%. C achieves 4%. And D achieves 5% admissions. Now, what does artificial intelligence do here? I instructed the developer to write a code in such a manner that the data with highest conversion rate goes to the best performing counselors. 
that means A's performance rate could improve from 7% to 12%, which means a higher conversion rate, higher number of admissions in less amount of time. The artificial intelligence delegates the data to the counselors according to their performance. In a span of 8 years, 1 million data were processed, of which 40,000 admissions were secured. If you are an educational institution, we can provide you with quality data, optimize your digital marketing campaign, an increase in conversion rate, an increase in admissions, and decrease in manpower. That's all for this video. This was the last video in this series. Stay tuned for more such informative videos. For further information regarding our work, please visit doptin.com. Please like, share and subscribe to this channel and click on the bell icon so that you get notified when the next video is uploaded. Thank you so much for watching.